Ah, hey, didn't see you there. Welcome to Hammer and Ales. Have you ever wanted to drink different exotic beers, build things, and fix broken shit? Well, you've come to the right place. I'm Mark, and I'm going to show you exactly how to do those things. And sit tight, because this week, we're going to be building the license plate birdhouse. pieces let's get ready to put them together i started by using an eight foot piece of white pine and you can find this at any local hardware store i then cut it into a 40 inch piece now the both front and back pieces are 10 inches tall with a 45 degree angle for the roof and you can tell it's a 45 degree angle by using your square and i know what most of you are thinking well mark that ain't no square that's a triangle but it's called a square because of this right here. It makes it a square cut or a square edge. And we can see that on these right here. The walls are an important piece. They need to be cut four and an eighth inches wide and seven inches tall. This allows for a little bit of an overhang on the roof when you put the license plate on. And lastly, the hole I drilled is a one and an eighth inch diameter, which is perfect for birds like finches, chickadees, maybe even a dick thistle if you're into that sort of thing. It's 2021, who am I to judge? Now, if your hole is too big, it probably means you're not interested in the average size bird with good credit and a nice car. So keep that in mind. An inch and an eighth hole is what you need to drill. Now, for the part you've all been waiting for. Mystery beer. Ooh, that's real good.
let's see what we have. It's Wobbly Wheel IPA from Yellow Springs Brewery in Yellow Springs, Ohio. Now it's a smooth, incredibly drinkable IPA with a piney taste as far as IPAs go, but overall it's very delicious. Let's take a look at the can. Oh, nice. Very good artwork, kind of has a stained glass feel. Let's get a close up of this can. Hey, it's even a 9% alcohol beer. Okay. All right, let's assemble this birdhouse. I pre-drilled everything with a 1 16th inch drill bit, and I'm going to put everything together with these inch and a half hardened steel finish nails. And the roof will go on with these number six, five eighths screws. Here we go. Well, there you have it, folks. A handmade birdhouse, a good beer, and a great buzz. I put the measurements of everything in the description below, and I hope you liked this video. If so, like, comment, share, subscribe, all of the above so I can keep making them for you. Join us again on Hammer and Nails to see what we get into next.